RBI big series as well. He leads off and takes ball one. Opened up the scoring. Clark Schmidt getting going in the Yankee pen after a strong outing from Nestor Break. Is early on his fastball. Look, Mayhew lines that to right field. Of a table setter. He gives you quality at bats. He works the count. I mean, it feels like. Even LeMahieu's outs right now are just... He allows you to get closer and deeper into the bullpen. Broken bat, base hit. And to where defense has no chance to make a play. And this ball getting in back to make sure that it didn't get the catch of Chirinos. Making sure he was okay. And Judge with his eighth hit of the series as his bat splinters in two. But he's strong enough to still make it a hard line. Strike one to Rizzo. Oh, and two. Came around to score. On Kinder Fal. Does just to give himself a little bit more barrel control. And we've seen many a two-strike home run from Rizzo with that serious choke. Poked up the middle on the backhand. Glove flip to second for one. As Mateo nearly turned a slick up. How exciting of a player he really is. About to say, wow, what a outstanding play by Jorge Mateo. Lined out to right his last time up. Huh? Lines this one to center field. That'll get it. Knowing that Aiken's going to throw strikes. Here's Carpenter. Singled and scored in the sixth. Carpenter, it's a towering fly ball goal to make the catch for the final out at the top of the seventh. We will keep Marwin Gonzalez goes into right field. Mark Schmidt goes to the mound. Back with the Yankees after they've been Nevin, Chirinos, and Mateo. The Yankee pen. And the first pitch is down, 1-0. One 1-1. Oh. One one. Meredith, I know you are. They need him. They're going to plug him in, uh, and he'll be ready to go. One thing he said this season that he's back and forth between the majors and the minors, but you're also serving in different roles, and that's one role and really harp on maintaining a good routine as Tyler Nevin leads in the minors. But, of course, he is happy to be back here. Now, as a guy coming out of the bull, the difference for him while he was in the minors starting that he really just tried to remember instead attack him. Holmes, he's a guy that was his catch partner prior to being sent down. They're both sinker season. We could use a Clay Holmes double play sinker ball right now. The Yankees have an off day tomorrow, and then there's a strike. And official yet. Two and one. Thinning of a scorcher like this in the outfield. How hard is the pace of play so far today? It, it all depends on the guy on the mound. You know, you, you can stay on your toes, so you can stay locked in and engaged because this this point of the game, that Sun Torino's swing and a miss. The outfield. What am I going to eat later? And you know what, what show I might watch? So you want to stay this in the years? And right now, pretty efficient. Big swing and a miss on the outer half. Good arm action. Good tunneling. Looks like a force. And I said, you know how hard. Is Clay Holmes is going to finish things out, right? Everybody else, and Peralta, okay, back end guy, but you, know, 
you, you always go through pockets of a season where that's the case. You have to navigate. Marinaccio back. Mateo skies that into makes the catch for the second out. Little communication issue right here, but Aaron Hicks comfortable out there in center taking. He's out there. He's he's taking control. He's being aggressive going to the ball. And then you have a guy. One and one. A crowd of twenty five thousand six hundred about thirty six thousand last night. Probably about ten thousand filed in. And he's ahead in the count three and oh with a five run lead is Walk Mullins. And he walked him on four pitches. So first and second now with two out. And here is Mancini. Mancini has Schmidt a while now, and he said, I've been waiting for that wa big wave, and this year it just hasn't. He said, I think the culture is really starting to get in place. It's a very exciting time in a rebuild. It's the first big step. And as you, the last couple of seasons, one and two. And this group is growing between the night out. They're going to have to compete. They're yeah. going to have to bring their A game. And you see it when they, um, you know, St. Louis. So you've seen the growth. And you watched it last night in that comeback big. Like, we believe that we can play with anybody. And I think you are seeing the change of. The 2 2. Grounded to short. Kiner Falefa will go to the bottom of the seventh. Orioles might. Ground ball to short. Took a second to get out of the glove of Kiner Falefa. And hustling in the second. And wow, he's okay. out, they but barely. So that end. Talking about it earlier, said he always loves just the buzz it creates in the city. Hyundai scoreboard, Yankee fourth game. We'll face Hicks, Kiner Falefa, and Trevino. Zar, you know those two games are going to feel big. Ball one there. Left knee a little bit, and now he is going to be checked on. That could be a cramp, maybe. Oh, yeah, that could possibly mix. Five nothing game with that sun just beating on you. You've on a warm day like today as Hicks cuts through that. Signed a minor league deal with the Orioles in November. Called up just before the All-Star break on July 10th. You know, Cam, Hawaii 5 -0. Uh Heard of and never seen it. <laughs> Hicks works a walk. And now we will have. Who will take some bragging rights back home. That's right. After this matchup. Grounded to third on the backhand. Nevin to second for one. On to first. Plays the game right. Always a hard 90. From Isaiah Kiner for left foot. And you see him right there. Who will have the bragging rights <laughs> out in the Pacific. One and all. I can't talk about it enough, Ryan. You know, it's, it's the tale of two, two different things. That missed inside. Inspired the pinstripes have has allowed him to be he talked about it, you know, so many times this year and have a lot of success. Now we always hear about the what ways can it actually make you better? Well, for me, you know, you're ready to go play. You, you know the investment of the fans, the staff, the element that he's brought to the Yankees this season. It's exactly what Cash wanted a guy that can still base. Make sure you're getting a simple but quality. Kiner Falefa picks up his 14th stolen bats. Trevino laces his fourth hit of the game into left. So he has to hold up at third, and he says, my bad. 
as Jose Trevino has him to continue to move for Joey Gallo to give him an opportunity to drop this run in. Jose. And this is a tough read from IKF. I know he said my bad, but a low line drive, he played this. Trevino started and stopped. 1 0. And provides some more damage for the Yankees' offense. The 1 0. Gallo pops that up. Check on first. 2-1. Two, 2-2. Two two. A 2-2. Two, two. Swing and a miss. Two of his outs, though, were just stung to center. Two out. Bayhew is one for Garcia deals. Fouled straight back, one and one. Lemayu grounds it 